Let me situate this in context. It has been observed that the way the terrorist groups operate in the sub-region is mainly to gain control of mining areas, to obtain revenue, as well as to recruit young persons who are mostly disillusioned with state authorities. Take Mali, for instance. There have been reports of heightened competition among the jihadist groups, the Tuareg separatists, and the Malian authorities have been fighting over the control of the Gao region of northern Mali. And this is because of the recent discovery of gold deposits in that area. Also, there has been a surge in terrorist attacks in gold mining communities in Burkina Faso, in Mali, and Niger. Wherever the terrorists have operated, they have always been attracted to the gold mining areas. So a convergence of these statistics and trends, and when we consider Ghana's abandoned gold resources and our proximity to the Gulf of Guinea, there is this clear indication that Ghana, our country, remains a prime target for terrorist groups. And in view of the fact that the expansionist ambition of terrorists transcends borders, and the fact that the spillover effects of terrorism affect countries that are not directly under terrorist control, the imperativeness of concerted and collaborative efforts by all countries in the region to curb terrorism cannot be overemphasized. It is important for us in Ghana that we are able to prevent them from coming in the first place. What we have observed is that you could probably with one million pounds be able to st stop them and prevent them from coming. But once they enter, you need more than a billion pounds to be able to drive them away. And most times, not with much success. And in cognizance of the fact that enhanced collaboration is key to countering terrorism in the region, our heads of state and governments of the coastal West African states, Ghana, Cote d'Ivoire, Togo, Benin, Burkina Faso, as far back as 2017, took pragmatic steps to institute security mechanisms to address our common threat. Hence, the Accra Initiative. Mm -hmm.